Hey guys, Corbin here. We got ourselves... This is the first Marvel Legends figure I've got since Hasbro. Is Hasbro who makes Marvel Legends? Alright, we'll go ahead and say it's Hasbro, because yeah, there it is, Hasbro. Um, since they have went all cardboard, no more plastic on their stuff. They're slowly integrating, integrating it. The Disney Plus figures, like She-Hulk, Miss Marvel, the ones I reviewed, I could have swore I saw online that it was advertised that those are going to be the first wave of cardboard. Guess I was mistaken because those came in, you know, with the plastic clear and everything and the plastic insides. I don't know what I was expecting because, yeah, it's all cardboard and they got to keep it in place. But I was not expecting this to be the inside. Was not expecting this at all. Um, we have Future Foundation Spider-Man Stealth Suit. I love the Future Foundation Spider-Man suit where it's all white with little bits of black. Stealth Suit's pretty nice too, but I definitely prefer the, uh, the, yeah, the, the regular version. Um... Yeah, so we, he's wrapped up in some plastic here. Uh, we got the best, there we go. And some paper. Um, there's some tape. Aside from the tape, I think that's all the plastic. That's what I've been seeing on like the Transformers, My Little Ponies, those from Hasbro that we get in the store. It'll say like all cardboard or all recycled, no plastic, and then like really small, except for tape. Um, so yeah, it seems like it'll probably just be tape. It's plastic in the packaging. Um, that's a little worrisome. Maybe it's because of the packaging. I don't, I don't know. His legs are very curved. You see? I mean, you can clearly see that. That is a little worrisome. I don't know if that's because of the packaging, if it's the figure. Maybe it was hot day when it shipped. Um, maybe it's because it's all squished in. I, I don't know. Maybe let me know if your guys' figures are all like that. I can't look and see if the other ones are like it because they you can't see and i know that's been a lot of people's problems i normally don't care too much about sculpts i normally with neck i will look at heads and like look at them very long to figure out which one's the best one marvel legends star wars black series lightning collection for the most part i just give them a quick glance and see which one seems the best but overall i'm not too I'm not picky enough that these boxes are going to deter me from buying them. But this does worry me that he's so curved like this. Um, yeah, uh, let's go ahead and show you the figure. Um, I think he definitely looks better in his white and black feature foundation suit, not this black and white uh, uh, stealth suit. Um, yeah, I mean... Past the knees, they get really curved. I mean, look at that. That is super curved. I'm trying to like straighten them out. I just don't really know how to without messing up the figure. Um, yeah, let's see. All right, so that's just the wrapping. This is the little pieces of papers that are in all action figures. I don't really know what they do or say. It shows you on the back pictures of what it'll come with. Most of them seem to just have hand accessories. Are they gonna keep doing build figures? Like, I don't think this was a wave, though, so that it should probably be fine. They'll probably still be builder figures. But it comes with webs and two different hands. Um, definitely, I mean, I, I was not expecting this. I don't know what I was expecting, but I don't mind this at all. You know, save the environment, save trees. Um, especially if we're using whatever plastic and crap it takes to make action figures and their accessories. Um, but, yeah, this, this, this warped leg thing, that... We gotta figure something out with that though, guys. I don't know what the deal is there. Good Lord, can I open this ever? That'd be so cool. I don't know what the deal is there. Maybe it's just a one-time thing, but that we should fix. Um, so yeah, we got two different hands here. Some webs. Oh, I'm getting them all tangled. Oh, good Lord. Good Lordy. Okay, well, there we go. Good God. Um, yeah, that, that sort of sucks. Um, does it show? I will say a problem with these packaging I have. It's fine to have, you know, here's the comic art. And if you even want on the front to make it look better, here's the concept art. But on the back, I feel like it should be legit pictures of the figure. I get concept art is a lot easier. But, like, it just it doesn't show what it fully is like, you know. Because the concept art doesn't always look like the actual, the finished product. Like, I'm pretty sure during the Last of Us figure review, I was talking... I'm pretty sure I did. Um, I thought the concept art for Ellie looked not very good, but then the actual figure looks a whole lot better. So it's like... 
Obviously all figures are gonna look even slightly different, but it's, I don't know. I just feel like it should have just be concept art all around. Um, I don't really know what to do here. Like, can I, like, I don't really know the best way to get these hanging off his hands. There's not like a way to do it. So we'll just sort of wrap it there and then it can be like, woohoo. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't really know what to do there. Um, basic articulation as all Marvel Legends figures. Um, I know people are always seem to look for looking for Spider-Man. Right now we do. We have the stealth suit. We have Iron Spider and Japanese Spider-Man, and then there's other Spider-Man stuff. But Marvel Legends. Brand new figures. We have those three in store. Maybe I'll review the others. I don't know. We'll see. I just wanted to check out one of these because it's like never opened the box because it is low key like a mystery. Um, yeah, his legs are still. It looks like they're slowly, slowly getting less warped, but uh, that that is going to be a problem there. And it, okay, he's standing. So, um, but yeah, the warpedness of his legs that is going to be a problem if that doesn't slowly go to not, you know, fix itself. Uh, hopefully not all figures are like that in the boxes. I don't know if it was too, tied too tight in these, squished too much in the cardboard, melted, you know, got all warped during like a very hot day in the boxes. I don't know. Uh, let me know guys down below if you guys have gotten any figures in these type of boxes. Have you had any problems like where the legs are all wonky or any body parts wonky like that? Um, but yeah, still it's a fine, Perfectly fine Marvel Legends figure, good paint, uh, good articulation, good detail. Literally just that one problem and hopefully it's like a one in a million thing. Um, let me know down below, have you guys got any of these fully cardboarded, you know, no plastic figures? And if so, what was your first one? And are you fine with it overall? Or are you like the people that are now boycotting like Hasbro and crap because they don't, you can't see inside. If you are an inbox collector, I 100% get you there because like, you might as well just get a little poster, a little print picture, put it on your wall because you can't see the actual figure if, if there's no window. So inbox collectors, I get. Me, I take them out, I pose them. So that, it doesn't bother me. Um, but yeah, let me know guys, what Marvel Legends have you already got where they are completely in the box like this? You know, like you can't see them. Um, and let me know as well if you had any leg problems. I will say he's posing very, very nicely. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with these webs though. I guess you gotta be more creative than me because I'm not, when it comes to stuff like this, I'm terrible at posing my figures and their accessories as you've probably seen in other videos. I don't know. But yeah guys, if you want one of these figures, come on down to either store, hop on the website, whatever snag yourself we got all sorts of spider-man figures in right now we got spider-man little statues good bit of spider-man stuff for the holiday season so come on in check it out posters behind me are always for sale in store guys come on down